Okay, so now I'm going to go over x-rays and probing. So for x-rays, every office is going to be a little different with their system. Um, this one has Patterson, and some office might have Dexterous or a different um, system that they use. So for this one, um, we just click on this icon down here, and then click Log In. So if you don't know how to get to their x-ray system, I would just ask the office and then um, they can show you how to do that. And then for Patterson, this screen will show up here. So on the left-hand side, these are previous um, x-rays that have been done, so you can just click on what you need. And then when you need a new x-ray, just go down to new exams, click on that, and then you can just pick what you need. So you have two bite wings for bite wings, a full set of x-rays. So we click on a full set, um, this will pop up, and then you just click on the box that you're going to start with and it will usually um, flash green when it's um, ready to take. So um, and that's a little bit about the x-rays and now I'm going to go over the probing so I'll just exit this. All right so for probing for this you'll want to click on this little icon here it says and you'll just click on that. Um, we'll just say, I know. Okay. So then the screen will pop up right here, and we'll just make it bigger here. Um, so you want to make sure you have any teeth that are missing in here. So it, this already has the wisdom teeth that are missing, and which I did in the chart. So I'll, I'll show you what I did there. So, we'll just, oops, we'll do this. All right, so for missing teeth, you'll just click on the teeth that you want. Um, so I did all the wisdom teeth here, all four of them, and I just clicked on them. And then I went over here and I clicked on this little icon right here, and it says missing, and you just click on that, and then it will take away those teeth. And then when you go back into Perio chart here, um, the teeth should be missing and these, this right here will show up with an M in red. So now, so you'll want to start, so up here, so this is the upper teeth, so this is the buckle, and this is the lingual down here, which will say L, and this will say F for facial, facial buckle, and then this down here is for the lower teeth, again, this is the lingual, and this is the facial. So, you can start up here on two distal buckle and you can just start typing in the pocket depths that you want. So this and we'll just go to each one like that. Um, for bleeding, if you have to enter any bleeding, you just click on the tooth that you want. So say two has some bleeding and you'll go over here on this side. And you'll just go to bleeding here, it's right there, and you'll just click on whatever is bleeding. So you click on all three, you can click on two, and then it will show up right here um, under bleeding. So again, so if we go to tooth number 11, you can just click anywhere and go over here and click on what you need, and it will show up there. And then for recession, you'll want to um, go back over here and click on GM. Make sure you're on the right two. So if I say 13, just click anywhere. And then go over here and type in what you need for um, how many millimeters of recession they have. So just do. And then you can click on the next box if you need to and enter in whatever you need to enter in there and then as well as here so and then that will show up here under gm so up here okay so that is um the perio chart and then to save it you'll just go up here and hit save exam all right.
so we'll get out of that. No. And that is a little bit about <clears throat> how to net fake and trick. So I hope this information helps a little bit for you guys.